family from the family. In that case, I was trying to separate the human beings to gather the human beings to listen to your words. Lord, I did not mean these people. Those who are in my life, so come and take your thoughts out. Lord, you know what I said. That we are taking care of the life of this heart. We send it a future to you, Lord. You take care of it. You have a plan for each one of us. Plan to be prosperous, Lord. Fulfill it for your glory. We ask all this in the precious name of our Lord and Jesus Christ. Amen. And that was it. I would like to thank all of you, the pastor, for having given me the international opportunity to come and share God's word here. And that's a great honor and privilege to be here. I love it because so many of my friends are here. Let us dwell on the topic as well as the passages that are meant to us. The topic is believing in Christ, the resurrection. And that will take it in six parts. And belief. Second, belief. Third, life on them and what it will be in heaven. Fourth, we are going to do. Fifth, what would be the assignments that we would have in eternity when we leave? And what the world, we are supposed to be more to us. And finally, a sum. Well, believe. That's the topic. Believe in Christ. We all believe. Because it's easy now. We are seeing so many of miracles. In fact, if Christianity has spread over so many continents and many people are coming to the law, it's all because of miracles. Before Christ died, after Elijah and Elisha, there was a big gap of miracles. Even John the Baptist didn't do it. Even when Jesus Christ was there, he was doing the maximum. The disciples were watching. And little did they went and came back to my door. They said, You are demon son, getting driven away. He said, Don't be happy about that. Be happy that your deeds are written in the book of your life. So, when did he tell you? That's why he could be happy, believe, even when Jesus Christ rose up. He even then didn't have a belief. Let us go for the first unbelief part. In the passage that was read to us in John, it says in the 21st verse, Mary and Martha didn't have much faith. That's what it comes to God. Martha said to Jesus, If we had been here, my brother would not have been, would not have died. So now they feel no chance. Because Israelites, Jews believe, maybe some chance are there if it's first day or second day. No chance of three days. And Jesus Christ tells on the fourth day. Absolutely no chance. So they are feeling why not did come few days earlier. Sadducees didn't believe. Pharisees and Sadducees were the two six of it. That comes in Luke 20 chapter 27 verse. Then Jesus was approached by some Sadducees, religious leaders who say, there is no resurrection from the dead. Apostle Paul exploits the Lucifer and Pharisees when he was in prison. His clash. And Pharisees will say, maybe hey, we have seen some angels, so where are you? Pulling him. The Lucifer didn't believe. Thomas didn't believe. Apostle Thomas didn't believe. You know that. That comes in John 20 27. Then he said to Thomas, Put your finger here and look at my hands. Put your hand in the wound in my side. Don't be faithless anymore. Which I did. Well, the disciples told Thomas, we saw the same device. And uh, this is a child and Thomas. But what's happening in Mark 16, chapter 14, verse, when Jesus is about to go to 
But what we find is, we did not study. Some of us are there. Some of us are there. I don't know how many of you have watched this WhatsApp, which I saw at Big Bang. Nice watch, uh, WhatsApp message. Eastern College, Medical College in New York. Of course, it's a very premier uh, college. Very costly. It should be given New York. And I went to a place of a short uh, trip. Very small room they gave because that's not a true standard. The tour gate told me, they told me, worry, but he gave us very costly, so the rooms will be small, but as you go, you begin to get it. It's a very costly place, so you can understand how much uh, a child has to pay. One lady, one lady, we have, and somebody will say to the board students who are all assembled there, there's going to be a Muslim lady, please stay back and take the turn on the board. And this lady will come, she's a professor. But I didn't know, sir, I to She her husband was also a professor at the same college. She will say, my husband, late husband has given one billion dollars and has spent it one other day, I want. Now I decided to give it out to the institution towards the fees. All of you. All of you need not pay any fees here after. Till you leave the college. You should see the tears and arguments of the children. No one jumping. But the day that these guys can go out without studying, <laughs> that's what you have to do. Oh, Jesus Christ has paid the fee. I need not study. You give me sheep. No. He wants it this time. He says, what we can decide is. Which means, all should be like that. How can you make a decision for you? You can make a decision first. Okay. So, we are all going down. Good. Next is, life can Below and what's going to be now. Life years below is going to be very brief. Time for study is 12 years. That's 3 years for graduation. Another 2 years for post graduation. Finished. After that, you will work for 30 years here. Similarly, our entire life is only 70 to 80 years here. In that, what will you learn? Then for eternity, you will use it. But if you don't study, you cannot use it. But how long are going to be here? If I ask all of you how much money you have in your purse, some may say immediately that I have to sum 2,200. Some may say, sir, give me two minutes, I count and tell you. But if I tell you how many days you are going to be on this year, and you have to step No, that was the genius. Even tomorrow, we don't know. Therefore, each minute we have to utilize it to learn, to be like this. Then why is he living as here? Very simple. You go to a wedding, you have seen a wedding. Who was master gathering? But at the moment, either we go first to give them gift, or first we go to party. We say, which will be better? Strategically, we plan in the friends so that we can give the gift and go to the. Party game party. But if they have only one party, and for the next people, if they said no four, how oh, angry will you become? To that chapter, back then, seven. Similarly, God is not bringing bad stuff to God's children to be caught here. If a great grandfather would have been here alive, we won't be sitting here. But if you are going to sit here for permanently, a great grandson cannot come. The bad stuff to God's kids, new years, each other. And that's what we see it in uh, Acts 17 26. From one man, he made all the nations that they should interact with the whole earth and mark out the appointed times in history. Mark out the appointed times. But fortunately, we know about birthday, but unfortunately, we don't know about birthday. So we have to be very, very careful. That's what I told uh, two days back I was going to St. John's uh, school, first school at Mandalay, for the teachers I was asked to uh, share the message, and it was a founder's school. But last month, then the day, they were celebrating by doing for all the poor and all. all the teachers were there. It was a uh, founder's day, I said that today the uh, founder died like, yes, in our Do you know when your founder was born? <laughs> I knew because the children are sitting there and on 23rd July they have begun a whole food 
for us now, only from us. He is not going to ask our questions from the cats and dogs. Only God has given the knowledge of good and evil and the choice to choose. I saw another apostle. When you come down from, come back from God, you can be on a red channel and green channel. A green channel just walk away and wait until you don't have anything to eat here. Red channel, you know, there are uh, so many gold and not uh, as under the crowd, you said, what do you use as soon as you do? The boss of this place, dogs and cats will go to a green channel. All the mighty will decide to the red channel. Because God is asking a lot. So my dear children of God, where God says, please go to ask for accounts, Ecclesiastes 12, 30, 14. Now all of these said this, this is the conclusion of the matter. Fear God and keep His commandments. But this is the duty of all mankind. He knows the students. God, He is the creator. We are the creations. Everybody is what He is going to ask. All mankind. For God to bring every again into judgment, including every hidden things, whether it's good or evil. We will ask for it. Because He has given you the choice to choose. Knowledge is no more than what is good and evil. Matthew 1 36, Jesus Christ himself says, But I tell you that everyone will have to give account on the day of judgment. For every empty word he has spoken, vain word he has spoken. For word you have to give account, how much you have to give for a deeds. John chapter 20 29. Do not be amazed at this. For a time is coming when all of you in the grave will hear his voice and come. Those who have done what is good will rise to live, and those who have done what is evil will rise to be condemned. Charge so us. Then, Revelation 22 12. Look, I am coming soon, my Lord is with me, and I will give each person according to what they have done. Daniel 12 2 3. Multitude who sleep in the dust of the earth will awake, some to everlasting life. Others to shame and everlasting mentor. Those who are wise will shine like the brightness of the heavens, and those who lead many to righteousness, like stars forever and ever. So you can go into darkness, you can get into light, or you can be a star. Choices. Now, come back to our same material. He is doing all these things, not for simply. Then there are some sayings. What is it? In Revelation 3, 21, he says, The one who, be, who is victorious, I give the right to say that we are my throne. Just as I was victorious, and sat down with my father in his throne. So, Father God made Jesus to sit in his throne because he was victorious. He completed his task, dying for us. None of us were done. If yes, brother just have a mistake and if uh, pastor comes and says you take a meeting, I will send you half a new region, but I think it's a key. He went to that extent, got all the sufferings for saving us. So he was victorious, he said to you. So what do you think? Jesus says, if you are victorious, what's the word? You took a seat in me, you might be close. But what? unfortunately, this is being revealed through Apostle John at the island of Patmos in the year 885. Paul was not there, Peter was not there to know about this because Paul was being headed in 63 64. Same as the case with Peter was spread upside down. So, whatever they thought, they were they telling and going. This secret is coming later, but we don't know what we can do. That so we have to put it and we have follow that we should sit in this throne. So what you should be, you should be victorious, but this is not that creation can sin. That time I will be the power. I have not given any Catholic way of his affectation. That was good in one or two. One child was written in one or two years after the cross. So they would have gone. So first is sin we have to win. Second verse, where does it say in Genesis 4, 6 and 7? Then the Lord said to Cain, Why are you calling me? Why is your face down cast? If you do what is right, do not be accepted. But if you do not do what is right, sin is crouching for you. The decision has you, but you must ask. You must rule over it. God purposely allowed him as to be a whole He wants a race who will obey him in spite of freedom, out of love. He doesn't want to make us robots. 